As the song goes, can you tell me how to get to Sesame Street? We found out from their newest puppeteer, Megan Pyphus Peace, who's been blazing trails just like the show always has. Well, we're here sitting on the stoop at 123 Sesame Street. What are your early memories of, of this program? All of the characters here were my friends. I watched them every day. I had a personal connection with the street. When I was three years old, I had a Sesame Street birthday party. We had a Sesame Street cake and an Elmo walk around character came out and Big Bird. Those friends would help her find her passion. When I was 10 years old, I had just changed to a new elementary school and had to make new friends. I was super shy. I went to a puppetry conference with a few members from my church. I was exposed to women ventriloquists, and I saw myself being able to open up just like them and uh, make something come alive in that moment. So I went home, I told my parents I wanted to become a ventriloquist. Megan's mom checking out VHS tapes from the library for her daughter. And Megan watched them over and over, starting to mimic them. I took my puppets to school and was cracking jokes during lunch break. And my teachers noticed and asked if I would perform in front of the whole school. Mm -hmm. and that was my very first performance. And what made me knew in that moment that that's what I wanted to do forever, to hold the attention of kids anywhere from three years old to 12 and make them laugh and smile, that became my joy. That joy continuing as she performed, seeing an opportunity to express herself. You don't go very far. Becoming known as the valedictorian ventriloquist. We all will go far if we are willing. And go far she did, okay. even taking her act on America's Got Talent. A stolen oh, wow. is all After graduating from Vanderbilt with degrees in economics and finance, she spent seven years in commercial real estate until. I found the Instagram page of the performer who does Abby Kadabi, Leslie Carrera Rudolph, and I just fangirled. I said, oh my God, I love your character and what you do with her. She DM'd me and said, you are a gift. What was it like when you first heard from Megan? There was something super warm and heartfelt about it. And so I, I went and I, I, I Googled her and I was blown away. I just felt like it was magic. Mm -hmm. I know that sounds really corny, but I do feel like it was a meeting of the hearts. Leslie was so impressed with Megan's talents, she became her mentor, sharing her material with Sesame's producer who invited Megan to audition. Last September, making history as the street's first full-time black female puppeteer. I immediately entered my the imagination of my childhood. I still wish I could figure out what kind of job I want to do when I grow up and entering the imagination of a lot of kids with six and three quarter year old Gabrielle. What is it like being here on Sesame Street? Oh, it's so much fun. Oh, the weather is always great. It's always sunny. Mm -hmm. You know, you should really consider being a meteorologist here. Megan, hoping her path to the pinnacle of puppetry inspires others. My goal is just to inspire girls to achieve whatever dream they have, mm -hmm. no matter their background, their zip code, or no matter the color of their skin. Sesame's executive producer believes representation is important. We want people to be able to see characters on screen and feel like they see themselves. Those friends that inspired her as a child are her best friends today. Who are some of your friends? Tell me about oh, it. Well, I got lots of friends. Mm -hmm. I got um, Prairie Dog, uh -huh. Abby, mm -hmm. Elmo, mm -hmm. Cookie Monster, mm -hmm. Gonger, mm -hmm. Grover, yeah. uh, Big Bird. So nice to meet you, Gabrielle. Oh, it's so nice to meet you too, Mr. Al. High five. Yeah. Woo! Woo! This boom. 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 Oh, that's a little high great. five I've ever yeah, seen. <laughs> it's so, I mean, she, she's just so terrific and, and so inspiring and, and lovely. She's a, she's a mom of two. She's got wow. a master's in business. Uh, and she says that her love, and she loves that kids love Sesame Street and hopes the idea growing up, watching Gabrielle, uh, as, as, mm. but Gabrielle's part of this iconic cast. That's I love amazing. that she had this wild idea, this, this hobby she wanted to do, and her mom helped her along it. and encouraged it. So Look important. at her now. So ah, that was good. All right.
Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.